This AQ! AQ! And the baby's coming out. Fellas, again, focus on yourself. That's what it is. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy AQ, and I'm back with another reaction video for you guys today. And today, we're going to do a reaction from Pop the Balloon or Fine Love, the Indianapolis edition. Let's jump right into the video. You're our, our next lady. Let's go. Okay. Uh, yeah. Mike, right here. All right, here. Here you go. Uh, give me your name, age, and what you do for a living. I'm Paige. I'm 29, and I'm a rapper. Okay. All right, then. Uh, would you look for in a relationship or a man? Um, uh, someone that will support me in what I do. Someone that's not overly possessive. And yeah, yeah. Okay, all right then, what's some deal breakers? Uh, if you got more than three baby mamas, that's okay. a problem. <laughs> um, and that's really it. You know. All right, then. Well, shit, without further ado, go ahead and reveal yourself. Oh, oh, I did that right now. Yeah, right now. Okay, all right, then. Let's uh, go over here. We have one pop balloon, so we just going to come over here and ask them what's the reason you pop this balloon. Uh, give me your name, age, and what's the reason you pop your balloon? I'm Larry. I'm 31. I got three baby mamas, and uh, you want to be a rapper. You know, I need someone to get a job or something. <laughs> Damn, bro. Three baby mamas is a lot. That's a lot of problems. But this chick is 29 and she's trying to be a rapper. Yo. Think about meeting a chick who's 29 and she's trying to be a rapper. It's like at some point as a woman, you got to give it up, man. Because 29, you really should be pushing like motherhood, marriage, family. Like when a woman is not thinking about those things at a crucial age at 29 no good bro fall back retreat leave her alone you can't save her trust me <laughs> a job or something do, do you have a job or are you full-time rapper i'm a waitress too but okay yeah I'm she's a we ain't doing that. damn bro straight red flags all over the place She's a waitress, but she's a full-time rapper. <laughs> this is crazy, man. Yeah. Too. <laughs> no doubt, no doubt. So uh, is this somebody your type or somebody you'd approach? Mm. Yes and no. It would she depend on the situation. Yes, it would depend. No doubt, no doubt. All right, you, you pop your balloon after the waitress. Yeah. So uh, give me your name and age, and what's the reason you pop your balloon? Story 31. I, you getting some money, so I, I like that. <clears throat> but, and I don't have a problem with the waitress, but at the same time, like, my lifestyle is expensive. So, and I'm not saying that I don't know. My rent is 2K. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I kind of got to get somebody that's up to my speed a little bit on there. Like on the income type, on the income type tip. Damn, okay. uh, I mean bartender. You never bartender. I'm gonna say, I mean that's on you. What the bartender? What the average bartender Stop income weekly? Me. I be making like fifteen hundred dollars a week. How much are you doing? Fifteen hundred a week. Fifteen hundred to win you know a week. Waitressing. That's, please. That's that's cool. That's cool. But for the most part, like a solid gig. Like I get what you're saying. You know what I'm saying yeah. something like a, consistent. Like a, like a yeah, I got you. I got you. Yeah. I got you. Well, no doubt. Like a career. Like a skill. Nothing is wrong with being a waitress, but in life, it's wise to acquire a skill because a, a because a skill will take you far in life. You will be able to generate revenue based on your skill. With a waitress, that's pretty much working for tips. And again, nothing is wrong with that, but longevity wise, it's probably not a good option. That's why it's always good to invest in a skill. Because a skill will allow you to keep making money for the rest of your life. Facts. 
I yeah, no you. doubt, no doubt. I um, we ain't even gonna go back Pretty to the top because we we got these last three guys with balloons. So what we're gonna do for this next round is we're gonna have you ask them one question, and we're gonna go down the line and ask them each individually. Start with bro. So I have to think of one question. One question. Um. And come in a little tighter for me. Yeah. Yeah. One question. Y'all had all that time back there. And I was back there thinking of questions back then too. Um, if where would you take me on a first date? There's my question. Okay, all right. Give me your name, age, and where would you take her on your first date? Wheel thirty nine. Uh, Rick's bow yard because he's beautiful by the water. Oh. Okay, then, bro, smooth. Aww. Hey, what's it? <laughs> Beautiful by the water, baby. You know what I'm saying? I know that's right. Uh, give me your name, age, and where would you take her on your first date? Lamont, 32, and shit, Netflix and shit. No, I'm just playing. Oh, <laughs> shit, probably, um, I don't know, probably out to eat or something. Nah, he ain't playing. He dead ass. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because he look at her like, shit, that's the most I'll do for her. For real. Netflix and chill. Nothing more. Facts. Oh shit! After you somewhere. Where? <laughs> where? Damn! Look at her. Where? Boy, I'm hungry. Where are you gonna take me to eat? Feed me, please. <laughs> Yo, these birds be hungry out here, bro. Look at her face. Here, nigga. Damn. So I'll probably ask you like what type of food you like, and then we we'll go from there. What type of food you like, so you can figure I out? Like Italian food. It's Italian. It's she she like Italian. Where y'all going? Shit, damn, I'll ask her to all. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm, no, oh, no, no, I'm a Libra, so if you don't know and I don't know, I'm a Libra. We're just gonna be driving yeah, in yeah, circles. <laughs> You're a Libra too. Yeah, yeah. my birthday's Saturday. I don't know. Yeah. Mine's Thursday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Shout out to y'all. Happy birthday. All right, then. You drive uh, in circles. That's what me. Fazoli's, you said? No. Nah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know no Italian restaurant, so I'll probably ask her her favorite spot there if she wanted to get Italian. Olive Garden. <laughs> shit, fuck it. That's where she go, yeah. We in there. I'm trying to help you, brother. Damn, you could have texted me. Damn, bro. Yeah. Me. Uh, give me your name, age, and where would you take her on our first date? Yeah, my name is Billy. I'm 31, and uh, I'll probably take you to like a concert or something because I'm heavy on the music. I actually rap too, so I know that's right. Spit something real quick. Yeah, real quick. For real? No, I, go ahead. Spit no, something for real. real. I did that. Spit something. Spit, spit something right something. now. Like a spit it right now. From a young age, I was named the prodigal son. I uh -huh. had to break a lot of rules to get a lot of shit done. Okay. And my mom said my hard head would get me into trouble. Yeah. I had to get up on my feet because that's when bitches love yeah. you. I went from selling candy to some dime bags. What? Write a couple raps. It was just to let time pass. I'm rocking the lunchroom. Oh shit, hey. that boy spit. He putting words together and it's making some sense. I started out hey. with a dream hey. and a driver's license. Hey. I stand in the <laughs> ring till I'm tired of fighting. Come on. I duck and I swing. Niggas try to bite me. I knock them out the game. Game like Michael Tyson. Period. Yeah. Oh, damn, hey. Hey. The boy got some bars. <laughs> Facts. The boy got some bars. Hey. Hey. Come on, I know hey. that's right. <laughs> hey, hey. Hey. Yo, after he jumped those bars, man, he gotta get some pussy, bro. Yo, it's gonna be crazy if she reject this man after he just dropped those bars. This is crazy. And she should spit some too. Because she a rapper. Let's hear what she got. No cap. No, no. no cap. Come on now. Yeah, you did that. Y'all thought he was playing. You did that. Yeah, you now. did that, boy. Pop that shit, boy. Pop that, that shit. That. All right, that. now, hold on, hold on. We're gonna get right to it, though. Without further ado, based off those questions, go ahead and pop one balloon. One? What, what, I, am I supposed to have something? You ain't got, no. You ain't got some toothpick no. and I provided Give them? Me one. This is insane. Because we just driving in circles. Yeah, is it is it because he was indecisive about yes. where it goes for an Italian restaurant? Because I'm indecisive. So we'd be all over too? the place. Are you indecisive? Yeah, I am. <laughs> <laughs> no, hey, at least you keep it real. Is it is yeah, it somebody your real. type or somebody you'd approach? Yeah, she definitely cool, yeah. Cool. Okay, okay, all right, then. So uh, we only got two balloons left, so we just, for this last round, we're going to have these guys ask you one question. Okay. So come on in a little closer. And uh, you already said your name and age, but go ahead and ask her any question. How many kids you got? Two. How many baby daddies? Two. <laughs> ah. 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 Yeah, I ain't going to lie, man. Two kids, two baby fathers. Nice nah, a wrap. <laughs> Fellas, 
If you meet a woman with two kids and two baby father, what you want to be? Baby daddy number three? She already showed you she's prone to making bad decisions. Because it's okay for a woman to um, pick the wrong dude one time, whatever. Shit happens. But back to back? Nah, man. Nah. Nah. Be wise out here, fellas. <laughs> That's a red flag. That's not a woman that you want to deal with, bro. Because she don't care. She's 29. She's a rapper. She's a waitress with two kids by two different men. It's crazy. Bro, you just rap for her love, bro. Damn, right? You rap Damn. for her love and you pop? What the fuck? <laughs> Damn, man. What you mean the man got standards, man? He's a wise man. He did say earlier, though, his, his, his max is one. Oh, so, uh, yeah. yeah. His max is one. Um, I got but, two uh, of them things. Is that the reason? You, what's the reason you pop your balloon, though? Yeah, the um, baby daddies. Two million baby daddies? Damn. No doubt. No That's doubt. Nice. And is this somebody your type or somebody you'd approach? Yeah. I like it. You got a nice little outfit on everything. Okay. All right. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, brother, uh, the reason you pop, because uh, is she over the max limit? Yeah, but you know what, man? I really didn't even want to pop it. It was so hard for me to pop it, man. But it's just, it's just that's that's my preference. You know what I mean? And so you, 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 <laughs> you <laughs> <laughs> so you, uh, you, you, you firm on you, you firm on just one kid, one baby, one, one kid only. You know, you know, it, the it could have been two kids, but the two baby daddies. That's hard for me. It's real hard for me because it's 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 too you know like your future is definitely important, but your past matters too. You get what I'm saying? And that's a lot to to carry into something new. You know what I mean? So no doubt, no doubt. Uh, is this somebody your type? Or somebody you? Yeah, approach? I might need a feature though, for real. But. You might have to talk after this for real. Uh, this, <laughs> you, you might have to talk after this for real. <laughs> you supposed to talk now, nigga. You talk yeah, nigga. after, nigga. Nah, you Damn. talk now or never. Right. Which one? Right. What are you trying to do? Now he got me confused. He don't want his balloon back. He firm on his one kid, man. So we just going to leave it at that. Uh, unfortunately, we wasn't able to find you no Damn. love today on Kicking With Too Cold. We almost had it, but we ain't kicking so up, man. Uh, but we do wish you the best in your future endeavors and shit. We'll see you at the end. Thank you, Paige. Yeah. All right, then. Give it up. It is what it is, man. The fellas weren't going. <laughs> they saw the signs. Fellas, the signs are always there, bro. Like, if you meet a chick, right, it don't matter how pretty she is, you got to pay attention to the decision that she made in her past. Do not think you could change a woman. If a woman have a pattern, that's who she is. All right? If she's showing that she have a past of being unstable. She's not used to being in long-term situations. It means that she don't know how to commit. It means that she's not disciplined enough to really be in a serious relationship. And as a man, you want to pay attention to that. Because like I always tell you dudes, bro. One thing about a bird, a bird always return back to the streets. Even if she have a kid with another man best believe she's going to return back to the streets and try to push her rap career all right well let's be wise out here man for real